What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. As you have almost come to the end of this month, meaning it's time for us to check out another episode of top 10 newly released free to play games that you can play right now during the month of March. And as always, all the games that I'm gonna mention in this video are brand new free to play games. You can download them right now on Steam. Honestly, we got a lot to cover in our today's video. So without wasting any time, let's get right into it. All right, starting at number 10, we got a brand new free to play strategy based card game set in the Wild West called 45. It's a brand new game that just released onto the team and kind of have that perfect mix between a card game, strategy game, and also a pure Wild West mayhem. Kind of remind me of the games like Red Dead Redemption, but completely a different experience. As a player, you have to explore the ever changing map, collect different cards, build your own deck, and ultimately battle and gun down your opponents. And the cards that you collect in this game kind of act as the bullet in your revolver and right now there are 50 different unique cards in the game you can collect and build your own strategies so the gameplay overall is quite innovative and refreshing it's a completely a free to play single play experience i recommend you guys to download and give it a try moving on next up we got another single player action game called bolt and punch it's a completely single player story game where you play as a character called lift and she's the last surviving human in this disarrayed food facility and you also got access to a pretty cool set of powerful abilities where you have to face the against relentless robots and ultimately bring them down. The game has a nice combination of exploration, fast-paced melee combat, bit of a parkour and puzzle elements as well. Overall, it's a very nice single-player game right now having positive reviews on Steam. All right, moving on next up, we got a pretty cool game for those who like to play more of a sports style games. And this is a game called Metaball. It's a brand new free-to-play fast-paced action-packed sports game where you literally play basketball on a hoverboard. I mean, it's very simple, very addictive, and they also include tons of fun cool game modes like challenges tournament mode quick play and also you can make your own custom games the game was in early access on steam for a while now but i'm happy to see the game is finally fully available on steam as well as on other major consoles playstation 4 playstation 5 and also xbox series consoles and the game does support cross-platform multiplayer which is always a great feature so jump in give it a try and let me know down below what you think Boomerang is a brand new free to play action adventure game that just got released into the steam like couple of days ago and it is extremely fun to play the concept is very simple in this game you have a boomerang who just throw it around and make a boomerang trail and you can slide alongside with it and the game is situated in these ancient ruins that floating in the sky so only way to navigate is your boomerang trail and you basically have to collect all the artifacts that hide inside these ruins an overall gameplay loop i would say is pretty fun you have to use your boomerang in a pretty skillful way to find the most efficient route to reach your targets it's a bit of a trial and error but once you get used to all the gameplay mechanics it's super fun to play around all right next up we got rabbit hole a brand new free-to-play 2d role like shooter where you play as a character called this who's someone who suddenly bought into this rabbit hole so you have to go underneath the surface explore it meet strange new characters collect different guns fight different enemies and bosses all in all attempt to find your heart again and overall game has a pretty nice kind of storybook like art style which i'm a big fan of and i recommend you guys to try this game out if you're interested in this type of 2d action genre and seems to be people are very much loving this game right now having more than 210 plus reviews on steam and they are very positive and the system requirements are also very much acceptable as well all right next up at number five we got a game called palia technically it's not a brand new game which was actually released back in last november exclusive to epic game store but i'm happy to say the game is finally available right now on steam it's a brand new free-to-play mmorpg style of a game with a combination of a lot of other gameplay elements like crafting cooking fishing base building and a lot of exploration in this beautiful colorful vibrant world visually the game looks very similar to fortnite in terms of art style and animation but it's a totally different game when it comes to gameplay right now the game is available on steam as well as on epic game store and it's pretty popular on steam right now having close to like 12,000 daily concurrent players so if you're looking for a fun rpg game this game is highly recommended all right next up we got a pretty cool little game right now having overwhelmingly positive reviews on steam which is a game called Doranko wanko it's a brand new free-to-play action game that let you play as a pretty little cute pomeranian puppy and all you gotta do is just make your master's home messy and dirty you can simply spread mud all over the floor and spray paint all around the house and just make it absolutely messy and the total amount of damage that you do will increase
increase as the room become more dirtier. It's a very casual, relaxing, cute little game and right now people are absolutely loving it on Steam and right now it's having close to like 600 plus reviews on Steam and they're all overwhelmingly positive so if you're looking for a fun little casual game to try out, this game is highly recommended. And talking about the games that having overwhelmingly positive reviews on Steam, next up we got another pretty interesting little indie title called Curiosity. It's a brand new free to play adventure slash puzzle type of a game with a very unique hand drawn art style which I'm a big fan of. The game has a very nice single player story with two protagonists and turn based battle with lot of focus on strategy and throughout your adventure you have to make lot of decisions, different choices which ultimately lead you to different end games. Overall it's a very interesting little game right now having overwhelmingly positive reviews on Steam having more than 700 plus reviews and very easy to run game even if you have a pretty potato system. So far we have mentioned tons of single player games so time for us to move on to last couple of games which is going to be both multiplayer. Alright starting with a game called DC2. The game was actually released back in last September but it was a paid game until a couple of weeks ago the game went completely free to play on Steam and you can download it right now. So it's basically an online social deduction horror survival game where you can either play as an innocent and try to stay alive or you can play as a cursed and try to hunt down the innocent players. And if you ever played the first DC game which was already a very popular free to play game you definitely know what you're getting into. So if you're interested in this type of horror survival game this is a great time to jump into. Right now the game is relatively popular on Steam having close to like 1000 daily players but overall reviews on Steam right now sitting at on mixed category. Nevertheless it's a pretty unique horror game right now completely free so I recommend you guys to check it out right now. Alright guys before moving on to the number one spot I just want to mention a couple of like prologue or demo versions of the game that which I found really interesting during this month starting with a game called Night Runners. It's a very cool looking kind of late 90s style Japanese street racing game kind of remind me of the classic Need for Speed games like Need for Speed Underground 1 and 2. It's a great game to check out right now the game is available on Steam it's only the prologue or the demo version but you can download it for completely free. Alright next up we got a game called Age of Water The First Voyage which is an upcoming action adventure game which is going to release in a couple of weeks time. It's a very interesting looking adventure game where you basically explore this post apocalyptic earth that is completely covered in water and you can download the prologue version right now completely free on Steam. Alright moving on at number one spot we got a game called Predecessor. It's probably a game that you already know it was on Steam for a while and it was a paid game but a couple of days ago the game went actually completely free to play on Steam and a lot of new players are jumping in for the first time. It's a third person action strategy game where you can select between 30 different unique heroes that have very unique and devastating abilities and you can play around in this massive battle arenas. There are a great variety of heroes you can choose according to your play style whether you want to play as a sharpshooter or focus on melee combat or you can play around with the magical elements. The game got a lot to offer you can do a lot of customization that kind of fits your play style and if you're coming from other hero shooters like Paladins or Overwatch 2 this game is probably going to be very similar and right now the game is actually pretty popular on Steam having close to like 4000 daily players. So if you're someone who enjoys this type of third person action game it's a great game to jump into and it's completely free right now there is no harming downloading and trying it out. Well there you have it guys 10 of the best brand new free to play games you can try out right now during the month of March and definitely go ahead and drop a comment down below what is your favorite game from our today's list and as always guys if you enjoy the content so far don't forget to go ahead and drop a like on the video and also subscribe to the channel because we cover all the brand new free to play games every single month and also we are so close to 50,000 subscribers so I catch you guys soon in my next video stay safe